before I declare any wars this time, this episode, uh, I'm going to go ahead and look for, um, people in my realm who are rulers. Um, who are not my religion. The Despot of Cyprus is one of them. He is 13. So in... Uh, about three years I need to make sure that he changes. That's a revolt. He's imprisoned. Okay. Year of Georgian revolt. Um, the despot of Egypt we can convert. And the ecumenical patriarch we will never be able to convert. So... That's fine. Um, do we have any dukes that are actually our vassal anymore? We do. I don't know if any of them are not Catholic. All looks like they are the right religion to me. He's recently new, so he wouldn't have... Converted to a heresy yet, I think. And everything else. It amazes me that there's a Slavic uh, per person with a duchy in my realm. Please tell me it's like a tyranny. No, never mind. Still. Hopefully they lose that and uh, this kid gets imprisoned and gets his titles revoked. But... The AI is dumb, so probably not going to happen. We'll wait for the conversion to happen. He agrees to convert. Okay, all of his, it looks like his heir is uh, Greek or uh, Greek Catholic already. And thanks to the Umayyads breaking their tr the truce I had with them by declaring a jihad on me, we're just going to go ahead, turn around, and declare a new holy war against them. Big duchy. They have all of Germany too, so I need to keep that in mind. Flanders is a big duchy. Poitou is not too bad. I wouldn't mind taking the du duchy of Provence though. Or Baden. Baden's small, though. Provence is... Two counties I don't have control of yet. Does he have any other... What, where all are his lands? So, Toledo. He has that. He's got place, land all over the place. Normandy is also a big duchy. But I think Flanders, if I remember right, is the way to go. Uh, because it's got one of the largest number of holdings in the game. Sure, let's go for it. Holy War for Flanders. And we will raise everything we can up here. Let's 
kind of a crap army. There's a big one. And anyone else? That's 50,000 almost. I need them to gather together somewhere where they won't get killed. Paris is kind of surrounded. All of this land up here is kind of surrounded. Alright, um, better idea. We'll take the ones in this area already and take them to Dijon. And then... Everyone in Italy will go to Rome, or uh, Piombino, actually. And we will raise the ships and take them up there. And hopefully we won't lose the war very quickly. Um... Something else I'd like to do is in my capital. I'd like to continue up to uh, continue to upgrade castle towns. N never mind. Um, I am maxed out on castle towns in Rome. Let's go with the other one then. And in Rome, castle walls? Maybe. Uh, no, I want to build the cataphract training ground in my capital. Um... Your wisdom and mercy are legendary. We propose that Duchess de Matra of Alger and Prince Stephanus of Roman Empire should get betrothed matrilineally. Decline? Yeah, no. Not gonna happen. Alright, we will move this army up to Ghent. Actually, no, we'll just go straight to... We'll go to uh, the uh, County Closest Towers. I'm going to move these ships to Piombino now. going to have this guy wait in Paris. We still haven't lost any sieges. That's uh, crazy to me because everyone is at war with us. Maybe nobody had anything in our land. Alright, these guys are almost there. So now they will go to Bruges. Those guys are going to arrive in a couple days. We lost the Siege of Augsburg. Alright. 
guys have arrived. Could have raised the troops in England too, but it's fine. What are the defenders in Artois like? Not bad. They're, that's actually really easy to assault, I think. Uh, let's go ahead and disband these ships. Still no trade post in built in Rome. Oh, and I have... Uh, so, okay, Slow Fever is in my capital, and I have my gates shut. I've had my gates shut for a long time, actually. guys are about to reach Artois. We have an, a Chancellor position op open. Um, I can make the Despot of Aragon the Chancellor. Let's go with Bulgaria instead. And yeah, he's fine doing what he's doing. So discontent, what can I do? No, it only affects uh, vassal liege opinion. I was thinking if I could uh, declare Fidel's conquest of Sindh on Maharaja Somasrava. Somasvara, the monster. Okay. One day there. We might not actually need uh, the 20,000 that are coming from Italy. Six days. They're done there. And there's the fleet carrying the 20,000. Like I said, we'll land them in Bruges. Move on to Pirin. That's four days. These guys are ready to go now. Absolute rule, uh, rule law in Abyssinia. I think I'm actually going to assault through all of the holdings. Because each one gets me a little bit of money. I could use money. He wants to get out, wants out of this. News from China. Emperor Li Lizong, Xi Lizong, the Chinese son of heaven, has died and been succeeded by Xi Xiaozong. Like his predecessor, the new emperor is known to believe in an open China. Apparently, he takes a special interest in finno magyar cultures, and but frowns on Tengri's. Uh, business as usual, then? So, I, I didn't notice, but I thought it was finno ugric It's not finno mag fin It's finno magyar now, not finno ugric finno ugric Not sure when that even changed. Do you want out? Yes, he does. There we go. Um, dock the ships. Disband the levies. Then disband the levy ship or the fleet, uh, the vassal levy ships.
Um, was there a Duke of... There was Duke of Flanders, or Emirate of Flanders. He's at war, though. So, let's find us a good ruler for Brussels. He actually looks like he would be a good one. Artois. Boulogne. Um, is there even a kingdom of Frisia anymore? There is. It's just tiny, though. That's Bektashi order, isn't it? It is. Um, where all do they have land? So he has something down there. Something in Provence. Oh, I'm actually surprised. I would have thought he would have had more. I'm not going to go to war with the, uh, war for the Ghent holdings yet because I think he's actually, yeah, he's actually in the defensive pack, and I'd prefer not to go to war just for those. Uh, how long before my truce with Mali's up? 10.07. Alright. So, I need a new target. We still have a truce with the Danes, right? Until 10.10. Pannonia? 10.08. Um... Abyssinia would probably be a valid target. They would. The Jalilids are also a valid target. Uh, the Abdalkays are 10-11 when, when the truce expires with them. Um, he's Ethiopian. Or, uh, not Ethiopian, Coptic. My offside. Duchy of Axum. Or Elodia. Any of those would work, actually. Is that... That's not the king of Egypt. No, Abyssinian. Right. I was going to say it wouldn't make sense if it was. Abyssinia also has land down here. Berbera. So. Is that an independent? It is. Duchy of Semyon, Duchy of and Duchy of Axum. Yeah, let's go with this guy. Uh this or Holy War for uh Lodia probably.
or Axum. No, let's go with Axum. That's his capital after all. Okay, so let's see what we can muster down in this area. All right, that's a good amount so far. Anyone else on the coast? Looks like it will be sufficient. Let's go to Southern Red Sea. Uh, Ermana Gildo of the Ermana Gildo uh, host, or Ermana Gildo's host, uh, has declared third. I'm not saying that name again. Host claim on Hispania war on Khalif Shamir. Wait, wait, wait. Okay. Just wanted to make sure I had everyone uh, selected. My wife is pregnant. Really? There's only 18,000 here? Hopefully that's enough. Um, let's send these ships back over here. I think I can get some more from people up here, maybe? I didn't bring the Syrians down, actually. Or Jerusalem, for that matter. So let's bring them down now. Still, it should be an easy uh, assault through these holdings, I hope. Watch me speak too soon on that. Alright, on to his capital. Hopefully we'll capture his heir or something. Got a couple armies going there. Yeah, that's fine. We have the Lollard Heresy in our realm somewhere. Tripoli, I think, is what it said. I don't think we captured anyone. Oh. We have a kinswoman who is a bastard. A daughter was born to sure name her after one of her grandmothers. Continue to assault. Does he already want out? He surrenders. Good. Or the Duchy of Axum. And 
and disband Vassal Levies. Uh, can he marry? He can. Grant him one of the new counties. And this one I want a relatively weak vassal who is who has some ships uh, some coastal land Georgia is Georgia's weak is the, are they in a revolt of some kind they are two different claims on Georgia the despot of Ireland I can see him having uh, quite a bit of ships um, someday. Transfer Axum to him. And then this guy gets the duchy. Can still usurp the petty kingdom of man. 1006 is whenever I can declare another war on the Kingdom of Pictland. He's still alive, so don't want to declare war on him. Still the same guy. Uh, the Jalilids are a valid target, but I don't think there's nothing I really want to... Oh, wait. There's an idea. Wait, are these... Okay, that's Abyssinia. That's not. That is. So... Let's do a... Holy War for Semyon. And once these guys dock up, I will raise the ships. Again. We will take them to Masawa. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Okay, we stopped some. We stopped them from coming to our land. A uh, famous herald, well versed in the diplomatic protocol, has arrived at our court. He is pro uh, proposing his service to us, at, uh, and our chamberlain is saying we can make good use of this man. Sure, why not? Name Tiberius. We've stolen some tech. Abyssinian Revolt. There's a couple duchies down there that I can actually. So let's finish this off quickly so that I can declare that war against the revolt. Galazian peasants. Semyon. I hope we can take his stuff with this army. If not, it might be a good idea. No. No. Resist it. Have faith in my troops. Why I have faith in my troops, I don't know. It's actually a really bad idea. Okay, never mind. It worked. We have a sickly son. He already has. So he has a Hippolytos, who is a brother, Constantinos. Let's go with 
a name I know I've used before. Alexandros. My court physician, Len Chuye, uh, is worried about my newborn son. Attempt to save him. Alright, uh, it seems as if whatever treatment Lin Chuye administered worked. Little Alexandros is much better, but now he appears to be no different than other children his age. And one more? 100%. Really, you went out of the war? Good. Your land is mine. Span that. Actually, just going to give it to this guy. Because now. Wait. Bishoprick of. Oh, okay. That was something being built up there. Okay, and now I'm going to declare a holy war on this guy. Uh, which one's bigger? Uh, that one by a single county. So it's Damot? Sure. And I will uh, conquer them in the next episode.